Good morning. Welcome to Mickey and My Craft. This is Hila, your host. Today, we're going to do some stitch alone. And at the same time, I'm going to be informing of some changes that I do to this channel. Uh, the situation is that, and I'm going to give you an update on my health. Um, the situation is that I have been reflecting since my episode at the hospital on critical care and um, so you know I have to make some changes but at the same time you're gonna watch me uh, cross stitching this beautiful uh, this is with silk thread this is my first silk kit that I bought I'm gonna post if I don't if I don't forget I'm gonna post uh, the video over here from Paint Some Way. If not, you can go to the playlist where I have it as a cross stitch uh, playlist. And uh, uh, it's one of the most recent from last year. You just type Paint Some Way and all the videos will come up. And this is the silky one that I've been dying to do to see how it does. Um, I will talk about some tips about the silk one you're gonna be watching me how to do this and how the the fabric is turning out and at the same time i'm giving you updates of what's gonna happen uh with the channel okay so i'm gonna fix the table and everything else i'm gonna fix myself position myself for cross stitching and i'll be right back but before we start, I forgot to tell you something. First of all, I'm going to show you how I keyed up the thread and why I didn't use this. Usually I use this one for um, cotton thread, but the silk thread tends to fall off of the place. So you have to... Uh, I bought this. It's a set of six. Okay? And uh, I kit it up in this one because it will keep better. This is a very slippery thread. So I, uh, I have to use this method of kitting up. Okay, and what I do over here is I put any leftover of the one of the thread that I have been using in the particular uh, number. Okay, so this is something to think about. Okay, and uh, let me put it aside over here. And let's get started. Another thing that this kit came from came with the frames. Okay, this one came with the uh, shard, the, the, the pattern uh, uh, in different sections. So what I'm doing, that is a total of eight. So what I'm doing is I'm starting over here on the top left and then I'm going to move over here, right, and then uh, follow the pages. So that's what I'm doing. I wanted to finish with that. I'm using this wax. This is a softer wax, more softer than this one. These are the ones that you usually use in a, in the round um, container. And but the thing is, it seems like the silky thread won't pick it up too well for me. I I don't know. Maybe it's a thing on me. So I have my gladiator symbol. And here it is. Here is my update. I've been working on this big one so I can finish it uh, all up. So let's get started. Let's get started. Okay, I'm probably going to have to pass this through the because this is very tricky i even have to do a knot on the top it's like the thread from the beaded cross stitch that comes off easily so let me do this i don't like it to do it like this well i 
just to you know have some leverage with this thread because it's very you see I have the even though I have the knot it tends to get loose so I have to you have to kind of grab the tail you know like this in your hand so you can grab it real tight but I love it uh, look at the the sheer that comes from from this uh, thread okay so let's get started I've been working on this one for a little while also on the ambilight so <clears throat> there's gonna be some changes uh, it turns out that the new medication that I'm taking for Crohn if you're not interested in that part you just can fast forward it um, I don't like to give uh, too much private information, but I like to make my uh, subscribers, the people, aware of what's going on so they don't think, well, you know, because uh, I'm usually not an inconsistent person, but I have been very inconsistent during this past year, and it looked like this year is going to continue but it's due to health issue it's not because I want it to be inconsistent so uh, one of the thing uh, Rimbok does is damage your heart and apparently this one damage not that much it's a gray one uh, the astolic dysfunction and uh, so um i just uh got off on the heart monitor for a week um i'm trying to mail it but you know the u.s postal service is terrible here in philadelphia and uh so the, when I went to the appointment with the doctor, he read the whole file on the hospital. And he told me, well, honestly, you are alive by miracle because, uh, because of everything that went up. I, I, I'm not going to bog you down. Uh, so... Um, I know uh, I have severe sepsis and there was some organ dysfunction um, some organs were about to shut down so uh, then I went to my pulmonary because the reason was because of the inf the flu influenza type A that's what I got with uh, pneumonia aggravated by a bacterial infection so oh this is no good oh okay uh, so I um, Oh, it look like it's missing out. So, you know, those type of things makes you reflect when you um, are in that situation about your life. You know, like taking stock of your life. And uh, I know I love craft. I love any kind of craft. I... Uh, Maybe that's why I haven't specialized in any type. Uh, but I consider myself proficient in all type of crafts. So, uh, or most types of craft, I should say. And you see what I mean with the... <laughs> we're going to be switching conversation between the silky thread problems that I get with the... With the update 
So, I'm glad that you're seeing this. So, you'll see that it, this is no easy task. Okay, but at least now I'm trying to fix one over here. So, So you have to take stock of your of your life and what is it uh, that you ultimately want to do. And something that I always liked was to help people and uh, but to help people in the practical way, uh, not just donate money. You understand what I'm saying? Uh, so. Um, one of the things that I started to do in 2018 was crochet, but I had to stop it due to my tendonitis on my left wrist and uh, and the arthritis start coming up. But the medications that I take for the other condition helps me with the arthritis. So I try with the yarn that I have. <coughs> I try uh, back again and so far so good so I've been working and I will show you in another video some other day uh, the items that I have worked that I've been working an item that I worked back in 2018 that was way before me thinking about putting up a channel so uh, and crochet I find it that it's a practical craft where you can create garment and help the less fortunate. You know, like donating blankets for babies in the hospital or donating blankets for the homeless. Uh, so, uh, that's something that I want to be able to do and at least leave that legacy just in case that, uh, you know, I check out. <laughs> so having said that, um, uh, my channel, I'm gonna keep the same name, no, it's nothing. And it's going to be once in a while. For now, I'm not doing tutorials on crochet. I'm just going to show you. We're going to do a lot of crochet alone if you want to. Um, I am um, learning some stitches. Um, and I will tell you what pattern it is, who it came from, and the channel because credit where credit is due and uh, but that's going to be a, like a once a week diamond painting is going to be the last thing I will do like right now I haven't done diamond painting for a long while so that probably is not going to be as often as it used to be I'm planning uh, doing some giveaway for those of you who are interested in diamond painting. Uh, I'm going to planning to do some giveaway. I'm going to keep some, especially the animal ones. Because uh, I could use it also for purpose of donating for animal shelters so we can create an auction. Uh, for the animal shelters. Uh, so, um, that's practically basically most of it. Um, usually the videos are going to be same. Uh, Thursday, Fridays, and Saturday. I don't know if Sunday I want to make video. I really need the resting. Uh, I know that I was being very aggressive 
like I have Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and sometimes Monday or sometimes Tuesday, even Tuesday. And that's pretty me. Um, that will be, if I do that again, that will be putting me in a pickle. Because now they're going to change <clears throat> my ring book to an infusion type of medication. I have to get three infusion and then one, um, then I have to be injected. Uh, after the three infusion, I have to have an injection on the 12th week after the infusion. And then... Um, every eight weeks. The medication is a sky racy. Again, it's a biological uh, that can have consequences and uh, they're watching because also they found me nodules in my thyroid, but they're okay. Uh, they found me nodules on my lawn. Those have to be watched every uh i think it's every six months i gotta have a ct scan i have my kidney stones bothering me because crone and kidney stones crone affects your kidneys and uh it turn, if you suffer from kidney stone it's gonna affect your kidney stones okay is definitely going to affect it. So I should do this section before finishing down here. So um, that's what it is regarding the Facebook groups. The big soccer canvas group, well, I still owe them a lot. So probably I'm going to send them uh, some of the diamond paintings because right now is kind of uh, a hardship me doing a gift card. I'm going to be honest with you. I'm not going to cover the skies with my hand. Uh, so... Uh, Probably to the winner. Monet, see if you watching this. Uh, this is at the 15 minutes, 54 seconds. Uh, if you want to create an event on my page, I can give you administrative power. I would not like to close the page. As a matter of fact, I would like to expand it and have uh, events in there but I would like to give you girls the I mean at least Monetsi who has been a great moderator and I owe her a lot I'm very thankful for that I haven't communicated with her um, So I, uh, Monet, if you're listening to this, I have not been able to count the points. Uh, if you can uh, help me with that, I just it, uh, it just that I'm falling behind in so many things that I don't know what to do. But you know. Uh, we can work it out. Let me know. I know that I'm asking you more than... <sighs> you have done a lot. I shouldn't have even been asking you more. But you proved to be a nice uh, person. Take a look at this. Oh my God. I'm probably going to have to close this one. Let's see how we troubleshoot this one. I'm sorry. Um, again, Monet, uh, 
if you're listening to this or please try to listen to this i'm gonna post this video in the big soccer cameras and in the uh beat stamp cross stitch which i'm gonna change it and i'm gonna put uh i'm gonna include over there the crochet i don't want to include diamond painting so you guys can post your crochet uh, work whips whatever i gotta cut this because this is i don't know let's see and uh <clears throat> okay i see what i did So I'm going to have to Okay I'm going to leave it like that And this one I'm going to have to cut it a little bit. If not, probably get me three new strands because it's giving me a lot of problem. And look at all that I have to cut. Just to level all three strands. <clears throat> I haven't worked on this for a while, so that's why... Uh, That's why I'm having this problem. I don't want this one to come off. So, um... Turns out that I'm gonna. Whoops. Hold on just a second because my needle just came out and I'm gonna have to change the thread. I'll be back. Oh boy, this thread has been giving me some problem. So let's try this again. Let me see.
it's like these strand I'm gonna have to I'll be back I gotta fix this I had to create a knot and uh, try to wrap it up on the back and I have ended up cutting it because these uh, these um, oh this one over here I'm gonna have to go up and do it over again oh my goodness So we have to, sometimes you have to use your hands. This one should not be there. You have to be careful. <clears throat> One thing is when this, you have to be careful when it gets stuck in the fabric. Because it might screw your stitch. Because this is silk. I mean, it's a synthetic silk. But, uh, oh boy. Do they give you a little bit of work? Okay, so here we are. I I don't know what I was saying, but uh, oh, I was talking about the groups. So I don't want to close any groups, but ultimately, if I have to close one group, will be the one with the diamond painting. But. Uh, You can create, I'll be watching, of course, for uh, drama and stuff like that. I don't want drama on my Facebook pages. But um, I can give you Monet side my messages. Uh, Monet, I can give you administrative right as administrator. And you can create any and you can uh, format it the way you want it. I'm going to be erasing... Um, <clears throat> the old rules and whatever uh, the G Google document because I don't need that information anymore so um, so let me know uh, under the comment of this video when I post this video into the group okay and uh well let's keep on hoping for the best i'm gonna stop it over here so i can take care of this part of the
Yeah, um, um, this is what I don't like. I don't like to get it stuck in the... I like the shine of this silk. It's just that you need to be doing a lot in order to practice how to handle this. And sometimes you gotta throw a shoot. Like right now I had to put the, the fabric like this so it won't get stuck on the corner. For this so pretty soon I'm gonna have a video of the crochet of the stuff that I that I did in 2018 <clears throat> before and so stuff that I've been doing lately because February I couldn't post a video because the doctor sent me to rest for the whole month so you know um, I have to do that So I'm waiting. I did this because this month is my birthday uh, on April 25th. So I gave myself a gift. And uh, my husband just bought me, just bought a TV. He told me for me to be able to watch it because most of the time now I'm at the on my positional bed uh, doing the craft so I uh, he bought a TV so we can put it in the bedroom and just use this area in the living room for filming Or for whenever he wants to watch TV. So, let's see what happens. I hope I'm trying to, you know, do the best that I can. Intense on my hurt, health. Uh... So this is an update. Let me know in the comments what you think. Uh, Monette, please communicate with me. I don't want to owe anything to anybody, but I'm in a uh, behind. I'm in a uh, uh, everything that I'm gonna be working on. It's going to be stuff that I already have. Uh, I still have my sponsors who send me diamond paintings once in a while. Um, I'm going to be sending, I'm going to be giving away uh, diamond painting. I'm going to be selling some, uh, especially the Diamond Art Club. But for the ladies who participated, on the big soccer last year, I'm gonna be giving them um, the diamond paintings. So, having said that, what do you think about these? Uh, Silky, I know that I had confronted a lot of problem and I had to stop, but the thing is, uh, once you get the hang of it, like right now, you know, I know we haven't done that much, but I'm trying to, you know, um, I'm 
I'm trying to do as much as I can. I got some bumpies over here that I should fix before cutting up. Oh, this one's okay, but this one's up here. Okay. So, I think this is it for today. Um, sorry if I broke you down with the update on my health and uh, what I'm planning to do so you will know. So, if you have uh, friends who like to crochet, because I want to uh, post that, and I'm going to see if I could try to do a, like a report on YouTube of all your postings. Okay? So, thank you for watching. This is it. This is all we did today. Uh, there is still a lot to do. So thank you for watching. Have a wonderful weekend. Thanks for your support. Keep us in your prayers. Don't forget to take care of yourself. Don't forget to hug and kiss your fur baby from Mickey and I. Until the next time, much love and peace to all of you. Bye.